Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? I know, I know, I haven't made a video for such a long time, but I want to do a quick update video to tell you guys what's been going on, why I haven't uploaded anything since like July or early August, and um, to tell you guys the rundown. Okay, first off, um, if you guys, once you guys been watching my Watch Dogs videos, I'll I mention it there since I've already recorded and finished them back in August 5th. Uh, but to give you the rundown, around like uh, late Ju June, I was working with someone from this from uh, this place called Abilities Inc. A guy from Video Motto. He was supposed to help me like create a resume to help me get a job and such. Obviously, he didn't. Obviously, thus far, he has helped, but he hasn't helped me get a job. I've been in several interviews and I haven't gotten anything yet. Which is really disappointing, but throughout that time, you know, in July in particular, when I did record, record some games, uh, but I didn't upload them yet, which I will soon. Um, throughout that time, late July, it was like July 28th, um, especially when uh, I had a, had a job, I had a job interview lined up invo involving some court, uh, it's just some court case, not a court case, but it's like it's, it's from the. Um, Central ice of courts. Uh, I was gonna be like do like a janitorial position there I was gonna be doing an interview on that and one of the positions they had available was 3 to 11 p.m uh, And I told my sister about that and uh, she's like all right cool, you know, uh, yeah, let's do this So and then we then eventually she brought me to a car dealership and uh, We were looking at some cars and eventually we did find a car that we liked uh, it was a 2006 Subaru Forester. Um, obviously, it's under my name, so it's I legally own the car. Uh, it's a used car, obviously, but uh, the, the whole point is, you know, I got the car. I was driving around with it, and obviously, you know, I, since I got my license and all that, um, so I've been driving with, I've been driving a car and all that stuff. Um, and I went to the interviews. I went to another interview with, with the, that my sister went with me. Um, and I went back to the other interview because uh, I had one interview was with the guy who was going to set me up with another interview with uh, the lady from, from uh, the uh, the corporate source who was the name of the company that did the uh, cleaning for for the central um, ISIL of courts uh, in in, the, in those buildings. Um, so I went to the first one, then I then the meeting went fine, and then I eventually I went to a different one on Friday. That one didn't really pan out that much because that was um, a bit longer to drive to, and my sister didn't like the neighborhood I was driving to. to. And then, and then the other guys say there was a lot of driving, like I have to drive to uh, Queens and uh, to all that stuff. And at the time, I just got my car. I was just starting to learn how to drive so, with that car. I mean, so my sister didn't think it was a good idea to me it's just for me going on highways and drive to Queens and all that stuff. And she said it was a little bit too much. So she said, "Yeah, we won't be doing that." <clears throat> She still wanted to bank on the other one with the three to eleven job. <clears throat> I liked it because it had benefits, <clears throat> like health benefits and such. But disregarding that, <clears throat> all right. So eventually, I you know eventually I went back to another interview with them around like uh, September because uh, the thing was. Um, I did the first two interviews. I did early August, and at that time, I wasn't I I wasn't really driving in August all that much until my mom came back, um, and um, I, I drove I drove like a week afterwards though, um, like in the first the, the week the week oh, almost like a week after I did like the interviews, <clears throat> and I went to uh, Costco with my sister. She was trying to get me on the highways and the, and and, the, and all that stuff to get me used to that because I never I didn't do that. As, as much, you know, obviously, you know, it's uh, <clears throat> getting on the highway is the tricky part, but staying on the highway, making sure you're stepping on the gas, you know, that was, you no, know, that, that's kind of easier, and then actually leaving the highway, it, it, those are the things that are going to be a little tricky, that I have to, like, getting on the highway, making sure I'm looking to make sure I have a, have a spot to move to, and then I'm going to have to leave off, so, like, again, it's like, you know, like I said, it's like touch and go, it's like you have to feel it while you're driving to get to get used to it, so... Um, I only did that. One, I, I did that twice actually. I, I I went on the highway once, leaving the um, the second interview for a job in in August. It was like August fifth, I think. Um, I think I'm gonna double check on this. It was like it was like a Friday. It was the fourth of August because the second of August I had that interview with that guy uh, from the corporate source, that court building, <clears throat> and then. Um, and then the following week, I, th I think it was actually a Wednesday. It wasn't actually a Friday. It was like the following Wednesday. 
so it was the ninth that I went with my sister. Uh, my sister came with me. She was a passenger, but I was driving. We went to Costco, so I, so we went on the highway to Costco and left on the highway from Costco. So <clears throat> only a couple times I've been on there. It's it's kind of tricky getting on the highway at first, though. I still have not gotten used to it, so I don't know how I'm gonna. I, eventually, I'm probably gonna do it and get used to it over time. But I'm just trying to get used to driving, feeling the car, which, which I have, by the way. But after that thing with Costco, I didn't really go and drive again on my car until my mom came back on the 27th of August because she was at Florida <clears throat> spending time with her family or her, like, sisters and brothers and all that stuff. And it had some other things to do with the, uh, uh, I, I think something to do with the selling of one of the houses or something for my grandfather who passed away, like, in 2014, I think. I, I could be wrong on that. Uh, with that being said, of course... Um, and then eventually in September, October, like I've been doing, like, I think sometime in September, I don't remember the time, but it was sometime in September I had an interview, uh, with the other lady called Anna from the corporate source on, on the, the white, it's not the white building, it was a brick building, it was like a red, uh, like a normal brick building when you think of red and like, and like the cement in between. Yeah, the other building I went to speak to the other guy, um, uh, I forget the guy's name already. I have it saved on my phone. I'm not gonna give him like the last names, but. Um, it was, Je yeah, it was Jeremy, um, you know, <clears throat> Jeremy was stationed in the white building, it wasn't a brick building, it was like a white, <clears throat> it was some sort of white building, so, regardless of the fact, I went over there, <clears throat> I spoke to her, um, then she wanted me to do some cleaning, uh, uh for one bathroom, uh, to see what my skill sets were. Now, now, apparently, at the end of I thought I did pretty well. I thought I spoke to her well. I thought it was, I told her, like, I didn't see this as a career, but I do want to, like, learn more about the cleaning and, and have and, and, you, and <laughs> have it as a job for, for me for right now. <clears throat> and I explained to her why I haven't had a job since leaving high school in 2006. <clears throat> and I explained to her that I've been putting applications in, I've been going to interviews, but nothing has come from it you know and because of the lack of getting anything you know personally i've gotten discouraged from doing anything but i you know but <clears throat> again that's what that's the whole point of me going to this guy vinny <clears throat> from uh abilities inc so he can help me get a job <clears throat> that was the whole point <clears throat> excuse me i have a frog in my throat um, so with that being said, of course, after all that, you know, it's, 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 it's a combination of being busy from real life stuff. And the other half of it is me just wanting to play games and not having to be bothered with recording and such. But I just want to let you guys know I'm still here. I'm still doing my stuff. Um, I did finish Watch Dogs, by the way. Um, and I put all, some of my games in folders, as you can see. So, some of my also, I... Some I also I put all them back. Some I redownloaded again. For example, I redownloaded Grand Theft Auto, and I would play, I would I played that on my own. I actually beat the game. It was actually pretty fun. I barely got any of the trophies for it though. If you think about it, fifteen percent of the trophies. <clears throat> Top earned trophy: deliver a bail bond target alive. Apparently, that's really ultra rare for some reason. I don't know idea. Um. I've been playing Destiny 2 on my own. I, I'm probably not going to be doing this like I'm recording, especially with Destiny 1, only because I don't know if anyone wants to watch any of that crap. I do have this, but I haven't played that yet. And I was thinking about maybe doing, uh, maybe like, 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 like just live streaming like the, uh, the, the sports games, not necessarily like doing like playthroughs of it. Well, we'll have to see because the prelude does have a storyline to it. Well, the NBA 2K18 does have storyline to it, but... <clears throat> it's not nearly as good, and of course, <clears throat> as you guys know, Neo. The final update, one of the final updates was uh, uh, released. Um, the last DLC has came out of it. I actually finished the second DLC. The problem is, I wanted to wait until I finished uploading all my other Neo content. Like I have a couple, of, a couple of videos left of uh, uh, Way of the Strong. And then I'm gonna jump right into <clears throat> uploading the. Um, the final, or the third, second DLC rather, and then I'm gonna start recording the final DLC for Neo. I also redownload. I also, all these are uh, all these, buying from Dark Souls 2, and I think Final Fantasy 7. 
and Lords of the Fallen and Bloodborne are all on uh, the, the hard drive. So this is on a hard drive, the external. This one's on the external. This one, this one, this one's all on, on the external. I also have San Andreas too. If I want to record that, I can always record that for you know, a playthrough down the line. Um, I still need to continue with Dark Souls 2, Skull of the First Sin. Again, I have I started that. I didn't finish it. Um, let me see. Just double check. Yeah, th yeah. this is on the uh, system storage, okay? And so is this one, I believe, right? Yeah. This one as well. Yeah. Alright. I actually I actually put that back on there because I was just playing on my own. Uh, I still have New Game Plus of that if I wanted to m mess around with that. Um... But what I want to get into, I actually want to, what I want to do later on today, since I already beat Watch Dogs, I want to finish Dishonored. I'm going to try my best to finish Dishonored today, recording, and then what I want to do is, um, maybe for a little bit restart Final uh, Resident Evil 1 again, and do like the Jill's version of it. Because if you guys remember, I only, uh, did I, uh, upload these? Pretty sure I did. A lot. They use the same data. Are you serious? Wow. Check that out. Yeah, they use the exact same thing. Yeah. Yeah. What I want to do is I want to want to play. Want to record a little bit of Resident Evil One again. I use Jill this time because, as you guys know, uh, it's Halloween coming up. I mean, so I'll just play a little bit of that and just upload that for like Halloween, you know. <laughs> I already I already did this with Chris's side. I didn't do it with Jill's side. I've been meaning to do this and I've been waiting heavily on information involving Resident Evil 2 rem remake, which has not come about. But outside of that, guys, I have been uh, the Creation Club thing has came out for Skyrim and Fallout 4. Uh, the Creation Club content is limited, but I'm hopeful that it's going to come with decent content if you want. There's a few things I like from Fallout 4 Creation Club which is gonna which costs money obviously but one is the Chinese stealth armor and a f I may and, and uh, the um, the backpack that increases your carrying capacity by a hundred points. That's fucking sick man. I'm totally gonna get that first I think. Um Watch Dogs, like I said, I already beat this, but there is the expansion with T-Bone, which I'm probably going to start doing too, but anyway guys, i sorry for the r random uh, big update, but I have to, well I don't say big update, but i uh, sorry about rambling, but I just want to let you guys know I'm still here, I haven't died off, there's a few videos I uploaded where it has no audio, no uh, voiceovers as well, I did that with Fallout 4, and this one I did with, uh, with um, Neo, uh, just to, you know, just to show something different uh, to someone on Discord about like my damage test with um, Ganryu um, from uh, the second DLC, which you guys will be seeing that coming up real soon. But I, but I am gonna be doing a little. I actually I may want to do. I may want to start Watch Dogs the DLC first, then switch back to Dishonored because there's only a couple missions w with T Bone. Or I'll see. I'll, I'll, how about this? I'll split it up. I'll do. I'll do a couple. Of I'll do a couple of progress on this. If it's actually really short and I'm almost close to beating it, then I'll probably beat this first. And then later on today, I'll switch over to uh, Watch Dogs and play a little bit of Watch Dogs the uh, expansion. There is the Middle Earth Shadow of War that just came out, which is actually the sequel to Shadows of Mordor, uh, which again is another game I fucking loved, by the way. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna. I don't know if I'm gonna enjoy that game as much as Shadows of War. The reason why I'm saying that is because it's heavily based on gathering an army, and every time you lose a battle to another ar to another orc army, something else happens. And, and, and the storyline is there, but I, I just don't know if it's gonna be for me. I, at least I don't know if it's gonna be worth spending sixty dollars on. So I'm probably gonna make a. I'm probably gonna take a pass on Sh Shadows of War until it's a little bit cheaper. Maybe it's on a flat. Maybe it's on a flash deal. And it's like twenty five. Maybe I'll pick it up or thirty dollars. I may pick it up, but I'm not gonna be spending sixty dollars on Shadows of War. Um, so I don't know exactly. Actually, I probably would want to get the physical copy just so I could have it because I have the physical copy here for Shadows of War, uh, Shadows of Mordor. Excuse me. But outside of that, guys, thank you much for watching my ramblings. Um, there is other gameplay videos I'm gonna be doing. I actually may just start First Light, honestly, or I may just start. 
Uh, I have another game I got. I may just start Thief. I have one of those two. Thief, I think, is primarily stealth based. Um, <clears throat> so I may, and stealing stuff. So I'm probably gonna probably do Thief at some point for sure. I do, like I said, I do have San Andreas. Obviously, San Andreas is a different type of game. It's kind of similar to Watch Dogs without the hacking. Um, so there's that. I can also go back to Dark Souls 2 because I actually love Dark Souls 1. I mean, Dark Souls 2, excuse me. Dark Souls 1 I liked, but I didn't like it as much as Skull of the First Sin. And Dark Souls 3 overall, guys, I want to tell you right now, it was a good game, but at the exact same time, <clears throat> I think it was too much of a fe uh, of a, of a uh, Dark Souls 1 blowjobbing fest. <laughs> and, uh, so, I don't know. Anyway, guys, thank you much for watching. Sorry I rambled for 50 minutes, but hey, guys, now I'm still here. I'm still kicking, so... Peace out.